What can a flathead tell us about climate change? More than you'd think. Meet the Seamus team. They've been exploring the Southeast Marine Ecosystem aboard the mighty research vessel Investigator on a mission to uncover the secrets of the ocean food web. And here's our star, a sleek silvery flathead. It's an important scientific sample that we can learn from. Caught off the coast of Victoria, our little fish is sorted and given a unique ID. Think of it like a passport for science. Then our team takes a small tissue sample, bags it, tags it, and pops it in the vessel's freezer for the ride home. Back in the lab, we retrieve the sample and prep it for deep freeze, minus 80 degrees. Next stop is freeze drying. This process uses vacuum pressure to remove all the water, leaving behind just the tissue. Then we homogenize it. Basically, we carefully turn it into a fine powder. We take just half a milligram and place it into a little tin cup. Our ultra-sensitive scale makes sure it's just right. The sample goes into a mass spectrometer where we measure stable isotopes, carbon-13 and nitrogen-15. These isotopes tell us what fish eat and where they feed. More nitrogen-15 means it feeds higher up the food chain. Lower carbon-13 suggests it's been feeding in deeper waters. By analysing dozens of these samples, we build a picture of who eats whom and how those relationships change over time. Understanding the food web helps us to protect marine life, manage fisheries and track climate change impacts. One fish at a time, we're uncovering the story of the whole ecosystem. That's the power of science.